everyone, it's Twilight Gaming coming to you live from a mountain in Skyrim. Well, last time we left off, uh, we were in Bleak Falls Barrow and we had a huge, horrible uh, frame rate spike. And I was, well, it's not really a spike, more of a downturn because I, it was going at one frame per second. And I could barely move, let alone uh, commentate. So uh, I fixed that. I went out here. And there's one thing I want to do and show you before I actually collected it. If you look, when you come out, if you look right to the here, you're going to find a potion. Now, it's not the greatest potion, but it's something I don't see a lot of people noticing. So, I felt like I'd show it to you guys. Uh, and then, if you notice, you're, you're on a, a cliff. How do you get off? Well, you're going to be doing this a lot in Skyrim. When you dive down, you want to just kind of hop from rock to rock. And that's how you're going to want to do it. But anyways, why don't, why don't we just explore? Uh, I did a few things. I figured out my mod issue. Uh, it's got this weird bug where when you try to disable things, it'll just re-enable it. So you gotta kind of work around it. Or just going in and out, in and out, in and out until you're done. So I just uh, enabled the... Um Excuse me. <sighs> I just... <laughs> I just enabled the uh, DLC content um, and then horse armor. So that's all that I'm going to be using for this one. That is... You know, this game, it's just so beautiful. I mean, you just, I just want to sit here. What? I just, I just, I really just want to sit here and do nothing because I, I want to live next to someplace like this. But anyways, if you open your map, we'll show you where we are. We are all the way over here. We're, we're, we're actually quite near the Guardian Stones in this area. This whole lake right here. This lake goes on quite a ways. So why don't we just move this way. Um, to those veteran players, uh, yes, we can fast travel. Do I want to? Not really, because I'd really like to show you guys the game. Um, it's just, it's, it's one of the biggest parts of this game is, of course, um... Exploring and I just kind of want to do some of that with you guys Because we won't be doing a lot of it. I will be doing a lot of the running to places um, outside of the game, so I just I want Guys Whoa, whoa, whoa Whoa guys that that was nuts Holy cow, um, taking your flowers, if we don't mind. Is anyone in here? Well, there's obviously someone here, because otherwise it wouldn't be steel. So let's go find whoever lives here. I'm just a ah! old woman, dear. No need to trouble yourself with me. Holy cow! Can you not do that? You're it's terrifying. Just scraping by out here, but I make do. Um. We got this trap door here. What's this old woman hiding? Not much. Looks like she's just a mage in her spare time. Not hiding any bodies or anything. She got in here. Nernroot? Yeah, Nernroots are pretty. Got some poisons up here. Ooh. Now I want that. Uh. Okay, I got that. Um. Death Bell. That's used to make potions. Nah, not much else. Poisons, I should say, not potions. Ooh, guys, let's read this. The Song of the Alchemists, Ancient Tales of the Dwemer, Part 5. Let's not. Anyways. The Giant's Toe. Man, you need a pedicure, man. Ugh. You got some issues. But I'm going to take it anyways. What is she eating? Pheasant roast. It's fools. None may 
know my secret. What's your secret? It's not that bad. All right. You're wearing mage robes. Uh. Guys, I'm, I'm kind of confused as to what's going on. Okay, well, whatever. Um, we're just gonna keep going. Uh, we're gonna forget that, you know, you know what? I'm just gonna go and steal some stuff because she's dead now. What's gonna happen? Try to kill me. Gimme, 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 gimme. No, I don't want, I don't want your kettle. No, I don't want it. Stop. Okay, um. What's that? Vegetable soup? Um, nom 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 nom. Um. There's really not much here, but you know, I guess, you know, she needs to get some serious work work done. When it rains, it rains. <laughs> there you are. What? What? Hi, Breton. Uh, why are you attacking me? Oh. Look at that face. Look at that face right there. It's terrifying. Just look at his eyes. He's like, one of his eyes is like pointing towards me and the other one's kind of pointing away, but they're still kind of looking at me. And then that walrus mustache right there. And he's all bald. <laughs> Holy cow, where did he come from, guys? Don't, why? Why are you guys attacking me? Okay, I'm running. I'm getting, I'm getting the heck out of here. This, this game is terrifying. First, a floating soul gem out in the middle of nowhere. Then, it becomes a house. And then I apparently go find her basement, which is nothing weird. I mean, she's just a mage. I mean, what's wrong with that? I guess maybe if you're Nord, that's bad. But I don't care. I'm an Imperial. I'm accepting. And then, and then she kills me for it. And... It's like, excuse me. Oh, that's my sword. Okay, I was like, oh, no, no, no more magic juice. Uh, anyways, um, let's head up here. Hey, no, buddy. Oh, no. Gimme. Okay, um. Here's our first instance of an iron vein. Uh, unfortunately, since we don't have um, a pickaxe, we can't actually mine it. But maybe some other time we can. This is basically where we were at before. So we're just going to leave. Just the other side of it. Why are my swords out? I have no idea, guys. Okay. And now we're back at Riverwood. See, in this plate, you just, you just discover so much if you don't fast travel, you know? And it, I'm not going to be killing a lot of rabbits. Sorry I did that, but it was fun. Um, boop. Guys, I don't want to get wet. So let's see if we can hop these stones. If my frame rate decides to... Hey, what's this? What's this? Ah, uh, doesn't that feel good? That mist? Ah, oh, it feels so nice. Ah, uh, here goes my thing of not wanting to get wet, but... Hi. Hi, uh, I really don't want to kill you. You're adorable. Um, can you just leave me alone? No, buddy. No, please. No, honey, buddy, please don't. You're really, really cute. Um, please don't. I don't want to hurt you. You want to be my pet? Hi. Okay. I guess I have a pet mud crab, guys. Um, come on, dude. I love you. I'll feed you lots of yummy food. I feed my hermits bananas sometimes. They really like it. And eggs. They like eggs, shrimp. Do you want some shrimp? I, can't, I really can't believe he's followed me this far. What the heck? Come on, dude. <laughs> what? Come on, dude. Let's go. 
Come on, buddy. Yeah. Um, for those who don't know, my crabs are really weak. I mean, I could hit one hit kill this guy, but I really think they're adorable and I really don't want to hurt them, so I'm not going to. There's a bee that just went by. That was pretty cool. A bee? To quote Tim. What? What? It's a mud crab! No! 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 Chicken! Just stay away! What? That was horrible! No! I just thought I was to take his chitin. That was horrible. Need something? Why are they hurting each other? They're not. He was my buddy. I got your dang claw. You found it. <laughs> there it is. Strange. It, it seems smaller than I remember. <laughs> Funny thing, huh? I'm going to put this back where it belongs. I'll, I'll never forget this. You've done a great thing for me and my sister. I'm glad that I could help, but can you bring my beautiful crab back to life? <sighs> well, we did that. We got the dragon stone, remember? And I really hope you guys did pick that up. Oh, his, his beautiful body's still there. I'm so sorry I let them kill you. <laughs> but anyways, uh, we gotta move on. No reason to cry over spilled crabs. If you take that out of context, that sounds horrible. But anyways, we're just going to keep going. Uh, instead of turning left here, we are going to be turning right. And we're going to head to Whiterun. Um, Whiterun is a fabulous place. It's probably one of my favorite cities here. And I'm sure it's a lot of people's favorite cities. Whenever I record, for some reason, I get so unbelievably tired that I always just have to yawn. I'm going hunting. I miss, like, a lot. Uh, guys, I gotta cut. Sorry, I gotta call. I'm sorry about that, guys. I got a call from a uh, classmate at one of my um, classes at, well, the only class I have at uh, college, and she uh, really needed uh, some help with an assignment, so I had to answer. I'm sorry. But anyways, um, we're back. You just <laughs> teleported. This game, guys, this game. Um, thanks. Uh, anyways, um, we're just gonna keep on going. We're gonna ignore the floating arrows and the levitating wolf, and we're just gonna keep on going. We're gonna look at the good things in life, not the demonic things. Always look at the good things, not the demonic things. Like this beautiful waterfall. And another great thing about this, and I just, I really wanna bring this to light. Okay, if you look really closely over there, see those specs? That's salmon jumping, and they do that really. Isn't that just awesome that they added that? I love that. And you can actually go over there and catch them too if you want. I just like to be quiet, you know, because some of the greatest parts of this game are just like, look at that. Wouldn't you love to look up and see that? But there's White Run, guys. There's Dragon Reach. And come right Run comes two of the main quest lines we are going to be doing. And I am super excited to get them started. It actually, one of my favorite quest lines starts in White Run. And uh, I enjoy it quite a bit. Pick that. Okay, pick that. Now, what we see here is a brewery. Uh, and I actually went to a winery the other day, and man, was that good. Ugh. But anyways, 
In case I do have young a young audience, I really don't want to <laughs> promote that. I'm, I'm not promoting it, though. Um, wait till you're of age. Anyways, it's locked. Requires key. Uh, but we can we can go over here. I'll show you guys what this is. When I first started playing this game, it was raining in the game, so it was incredibly dark. And I, for one, I was not used to this kind of a thing at all. I was not used to this open world type of game. I'm, I think I really grew up when it came to I'm consoles. As pla I'm not lost. You need something to do, or you just enjoy slowing down the hardworking folk. You're hardworking. Welcome. I'm the owner and proprietor of Hunting Brew Meadery. If you want to buy something, go find Sab Yorn. Otherwise, piss off. He comes. He's, he's important later. Uh, anyways. Uh, we, we will piss off, as he says to do. And, uh, we're going to go. Um, anyways. <laughs> I just, sometimes I just really enjoy the NPC talk in this game, because it, it gets funny. Wow, three butterflies, all different types. Oh, maybe these two are the same, but still. I thought they were birds at first. Ah, uh, first case of Nern Root. I believe it's our first case, at least. These guys are a little special. They do not grow back. So you want to harvest them with care, because they do not grow back. Um, that little har the horseshoe thing. Good enough. Oh, guys, you want to go over here. Well, that's taken care of. No thanks to you. Oh, I didn't do anything, actually. Certainly not. But a true warrior would have relished the opportunity to take on a giant. Did, didn't you That's voice... I'm here with my shield brothers. Didn't, didn't she voice that chick in Atlantis? That, that, that kind of mean chick, but she turned good in the end? Oh yeah, you did. What is a shield brother? An outsider, eh? Never heard of the companions? Uh, I'm, a, order I'm on holiday. We are brothers and sisters in honor. That's cool. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. Only for coin? Not for me to say. You'll have to talk to Codlac Whitemane up in Yorvaskar. Yorvaskar? The old man's got a good sense for people. He can look in your eyes and tell your worth. That's probably because he's old. If you go to him, good luck. Cool. So let, let's do that. Let's, let's go join the companions. It's a windmill. Picking a flower. Do you think they're going to let somebody who picks flowers for a living? Join, because I really like to pick flowers. Hi. Now, um, because I have a certain mod installed, it got rid of all their mane, so the horses don't actually have manes. Uh, but that's mostly because they look like this. Now, this is a mod I actually highly, if you have a Steam version, I really think you should install it, because um, these horses are awesome. This, this armor makes them invincible. So, uh, and horses, they unfortunately die quite often until you get, sh um, eight, I'm not gonna say, uh, until you get a certain horse that takes a very, it's very hard to kill. Uh, but, you know, people always run them off cliffs and it's just, and they're expensive, so. Hello. Come to chat with an old woman, hmm? Do your good deed for the day? No. Let's get up here. 